Hi, welcome to one more video of Sajo and Cards. Today we are discussing about the interior features of Toyota Rush 2021 model. Both side of the steering wheel, as usual, there is a switch for lights and the wipers. Coming to the left side door, driver side door, the chrome coated door handle, leather coated handrest, and the master switch mirror folding switch and the mirror adjusting switch they fit the system mirror folding both sides the mirror can be folded with a single switch now we can see the both sides mirrors are folding inside and outside by using the single switch the next one is the mirror position adjusting switch you can see a round switch there is two sides are indicating left side and right side is a written L and R. L means left side and R is right side. You just turn the switch to the left side then push the switch to wherever you want to tilt the mirror, mirror glass. You can see by pushing the switch the mirror glass is tilting sideways or up and down. We can tilt. If you select the switch to the R then you if you tilt then what happened in the right side mirror glass start to move up and down or sideways movement as we select near to the kick panel there are switches for uh, vsc switches uh, fog lamp switch and tire pressure reset switch and right side door hand you can see the leather coated armrest winder switch chrome coated door handle inner handle it's a dashboard it's a normal dashboard the budget car we cannot expect more from this one now we can go to the cluster assembly the cluster was says uh, left side you can see the rpm meter and right side a speedometer the three knobs are there left side knob is used to correct that time hour and center one is used to correct the minutes and the right side one is used to uh, control the odometer speed uh, trip meter and multi information display is there we can see a usb ports near to the central display unit this can be closed by a small cap attached to that this is the ac control panel ac mode switch is there AC auto switch is there, blower off switch is there. The small AC control panel. And coming down, there is a power socket near to the gear lever. In front of the gear lever, the gear lever panel is there. Then you can see the center console panel. It's a small one, as I told you. Again, coming to the front, you can see the hazard switch at the center between two AC vents. This is the remote unit, remote control unit for this car. Two remote control is there. It's a little bit different shape from other Toyota cars. Yeah, you can see uh, there is a manual key attached to this remote unit to open the door when the remote is not working or when the battery is not working. How to remove this manual key? Just push the knob to the right side then take out the manual key this is the procedure for remove the manual key just to insert there is nothing just insert it will be locked there detailed working of this center display panel we will do in another video now how to reset this uh, display panel just i will show you press here with some pin item with like tip of a pen press here then the system will automatically reset before start using this uh, display panel, some setting you have to do that also I will explain in that video. This is a settings button. You can see different settings are there. Okay. Please continue watch my channel then we can see that video. How to do the settings in the display panel. Now we can move to the other interior features. This is the three layer seating system. Front two seats are there the second layer there are three seats and the back side there are two seats 
AC vent is there at the top front and back seat if you go to the rear seat enough space is there for your legs and you feel comfort while traveling in this car there are three AC vents at the top for the rear passengers that the airflow you can adjust by the switch near to that AC vents one two three three vents you can see the AC blower speed also you can adjust the back side there are two seats if you need a space for your luggage you have to fold the seats it's easy to fold there are two lever at the sides of the seats just pull up the lever then the seat can be folded once the seat can be folded again by pulling the strip near to the center of the for more auto tips and tricks please watch our channel follow us thank you for watching bye bye Please subscribe if you like.